thing to bring garlic and they see you can what, whatever you keeps them away. They won't know. Yeah. They won't. Let's get face to fang with Mark Prater. Yeah, well, Mark, how's it going on the deck today? <laughs> I'd bring a high-powered weapon. <laughs> I mean, when Dracula shows up, eh, it's not so cool. But, uh, you know, we are just around the corner from Halloween, and it feels like we're in the middle of August. It's just very warm. Could be hotter, yes, but uh, right now we're still very, very warm for this time of the year. Let's start off with a uh, look at the drought just to give you an update. For those of you who didn't get to see it yesterday, Jefferson now included with Shelby counties into the exceptional drought. That is as high as it can go. Now, in 2007, about uh, two-thirds of the state was included in that, so this area continues to grow, and we need to watch it very carefully, especially when it comes to anything uh, burning. Right now, it's 85 degrees in Birmingham as well as Tuscaloosa. We did not reach the record of 86, but that could be changing over the weekend. 86 right now for those of you in Shelby County. A quick look at the radar across the southeast. Nobody is dealing with rain. It is absolutely bone dry. High pressure sitting on top of us right through tonight into early tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, notice temperatures into the low and mid 50s north of I-20, and then the quick turnaround tomorrow. This is at one o'clock. We're looking at temperatures around 86, 85 degrees in Birmingham, so it's going to be a hot one. And for those of you who are maybe headed to the Classic tomorrow, uh, it's going to be one of those days. You really need to make sure that you drink plenty of water and stay uh, hydrated because it is going to be 86 degrees at kickoff. Now, I know this is a big celebration time and a lot of fun for all of you, but just make sure that you have a chance to cool down as much as possible. Same in Oxford for the Auburn game. Alabama off this week. Temperatures into the mid-80s for tailgating. Then kickoff, we'll see 80 degrees. So the sun will have set by the time we get kickoff underway at 615. Here's a look at your hour-by-hour -hour forecast for the remainder of this evening into tonight. Temperatures dropping into the mid-60s by 10 o'clock, but plenty of clear skies. It's just going to be warm for high school football ball games going on tonight. 86 for tomorrow. Mostly sunny. This could be a record high. We'll see very dry. Winds out of the south at around 4 to 12. Here's your storm track 7 day and Halloween a high of 90. If that does happen in Birmingham, that would be the latest we've ever had a 90 degree reading. But at this point, there is absolutely no rain in the forecast through Wednesday and Thursday. There is a bit of a cool down that's hinted in our storm track forecast models, and we could be back into the 60s and 70s by next week. But again, the problem here is we will remain dry.